Hey, thanks for clicking on the video. I've had a lot of requests lately, uh, people wondering how I pack so much stuff on my four-wheeler to go on these trips. It does seem like I do pack a lot. Uh, I got it narrowed down pretty good now, just been going on so many trips and that's exactly what's going to happen here. You're going to see what you need, what you don't need, what you use, what you don't use, what you might have forgot. So uh, I'll go over this really quickly, a little quick rundown of everything. I'm not going to do reviews of anything, just a quick rundown on how I pack my gear. Alright, so as you guys can see, the most important thing I bring is my dog Wendell. Comes on all my trips. Uh, he loves it out here. This is his little, a uh, little bit bigger than a milk crate uh, carry case. It's all foam padded. Usually in the front, I'll have one cooler. This time I brought two. This cooler is all for my food, utensils, uh, some paper towels, some electrolyte drinks. This is uh, the more important cooler. This one has my beer. Lots of beer, lots of ice. So on this trip, I happen to be right by the ocean, so I did bring my fishing rod. In this uh, stuff sack, I have a uh, summer sleeping bag. It's part of my MSS, military sleep system. And in this bigger uh, waterproof bag is my the black bag in the military sleep system. It's the winter bag. I brought them both because it is supposed to get pretty chilly tonight, and I'd rather be too warm than uh, too cold. Threw a couple 2x4s just for some easy firewood to get it going. So here on the back, this is my Roto Pack. It's uh, 1.75 gallon or 6.6 .6 liters of extra fuel. Under here I have, uh, this is kind of like my emergency everything bag. I do have a few videos on it for trail tools, first aid kit, uh, a bunch of different things. Uh, I'll, maybe I'll put those down in the... Uh, video description if you guys want to check that out just this extra sweater some bag of chips <laughs> I got uh, this is my little Coleman single burner stove this is great some bug spray this is just a giant jug of water I don't always bring that but here I wasn't sure if I'd have fresh water to filter this stuff sack has uh, some extra clothes in it and my rain suit and this black bag over here in the far corner is my uh, camp cot all right, so this is my uh, backpack. Uh, it's kind of a military style bag. This time I threw in my uh, Thermarest uh, sleep pad. What else do I have? Okay, that's my uh, titanium uh, kettle with the drip over for my coffee. And my coffee's inside with some filters. That's my Sawyer Screes mini water filter coffee cup. The bag for Wendell's Rec Specs. Oh, I have my raincoat in there just for easy access. And I threw my tent without the pegs, or without the uh, poles, I mean, down in the bottom of the bag. That's an MSR Hubba Hubba NX2 two person tent. Love that tent. And in here, I got an assortment of flashlights, headlamps, and stuff. This is my Bitty Big Q uh, folding camp grill uh, with the bag my mother-in-law made me for it. Over on this side, this is my uh, Motomaster Eliminator power bank uh, with jumper cables built in in case I was to kill the battery somehow. I'd have a way of starting my machine. Super, super important if you guys have a newer machine that's uh, fuel injected. They don't have pull starts generally. so. It's good to have a way to start your machine if it's dead. Down here in the bottom, that's my Sportnir uh, folding chair. Toilet paper, don't need to explain it. A few fishing lures. That's my, underneath my tent, there's like a little footprint or a vapor barrier type thing. This is my emergency meal, it's a freeze dried meal. Kung Pao chicken. It's the Kung Pao. Mm. George likes his chicken spicy. I have uh, Wendell's bowl. I got a cast iron grill. That's everything for my bag and that's pretty much everything. All right guys, that's just a quick rundown of uh, what I bring with me and how I pack it for a summer camping trip. Obviously a winter camping trip, a little bit different. 
Usually I won't have Wendell's basket on the front because it takes up too much room. The tent I bring is bigger because it's usually a hot tent. I have to make room for my folding wood stove and stuff. But uh, it's basically other than that, it's all still the same basic gear, just different tent and the wood stove. But I uh, hope you guys liked it. I had a lot of requests for this one, so hopefully uh, it helps some of you guys out on your packing. The only thing I forgot to show you is that my tent poles for the MSR Hubba Hubba, I keep those separate and they're shoved down in the box with my hatchet and my folding uh, Boreal 21 Agua Cannon folding buck saw. I use it in a lot of my videos, but uh, yeah, those are a couple other things that were down in there. But uh, hope you guys liked it and let me know in the comments. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already a subscriber, and uh, thanks for checking out my video.